What's going on, guys? It's Atomic Revolutions here, and today we're going to be reacting to Right Away. Hey! One kills every DLC weapon in Black Ops 3. Hey, you, uh, you forgot about us. And there's Lance and Trevor. Saw it! Hey. Hi. I'm mad at Lance right now. Okay, don't mention it. He oh, said I really Colette! Colette! Oh my god, I only saw one dude! Yo, what is going on, YouTube? My name is Fridge, or right away, hopefully you guys are all having a wonderful day. So today, I'm bringing guys one kill with every DLC weapon in Black Ops 3. Hopefully you guys enjoy. Get in my way and try to block me, I'ma show aggression. Alrighty, boys, so we are going to be starting off with the submachine gun DLC weapons. The first one we got right here is the HG40, the MP4. If you ask me to name, like, every, like, a category of all DLC weapons, um, I bet I'd get them all. 40, whatever you want to call it, this thing is actually pretty awesome, man. We got him. Hey, you guys, let me know in the comment section any DLC weapons that I show in this video. If you guys have them on your Black Ops 3 account, let me know in the comment section. I'm always interested in seeing, you know, what DLC weapons you guys have on your Black Ops 3 accounts and all that good stuff. Alrighty, guys, so the next weapon we have right here is the DIY 11 Renovator, the freaking nail gun, boys. And I mean, this thing literally just shoots nails in Black Ops 3, and it's really awesome because the nails don't actually show up on the mini-map. So when you're shooting this thing, you're actually hidden. You're hidden on the mini-map, and I really, really like that a lot, man. So hopefully we can get a kill with this thing. It shouldn't be too difficult. I yeah. Nails. yeah. You should get that gun. Oh, I don't. I can't, like, just say, oh, I want it and get it. Really, really like the nail gun. A lot of cool attributes, and it's just a really fun weapon to use in general. And there we go. Moving on, we got the HLX4. This thing is actually super underrated, man. And uh, it's Wait, like a well, really unique sort of SMG four. because once you shoot it, you actually have to cock it back and before you actually start shooting again with this thing. So it's a little bit different than the other uh, kind of SMGs in Black Ops 3, but I really, really like it. So let me know in the comment section. If you guys have the HLX, this thing actually dominates one of the best, I would say. Next up, we have one of my favorites as well, the PPSH. You guys know I love the PPSH. Behind me... Oh my god, he's using like the carver knife and just, I don't know, trying to kill me. Look at these guys. They're all coming after me. Oh my god, Ripper shut down. Moving on, we got the AK-74U. Can we get a kill with this thing already? There we go, baby. It's kind of like a throwback DLC weapon. We've seen the AK-74U in Black Ops 1 and a couple other Call of Duties. All right, boys, we got some Nuketown, and we're starting off Nuketown with the XMC, man. So this weapon, I mean, what do I have to say? I, I, I can go on and on about the XMC all day, but it is still probably one of the best DLC weapons in the entire game. So let me know in the comment section if you guys have the XMC. Uh, uh, this thing dominates. No. It's so freaking good, and uh, you can't go wrong with it. You really can't go wrong with it. All right, guys, and finally, we have the last DLC submachine gun in Black Ops 3, this Sten. They literally just added this thing a couple of days ago, a couple of weeks ago, I guess, and uh, this thing is really, really fun to use, man. One of the most recent Whoa. DLC weapons in Black Ops 3. All right, guys, now it is time to move on to the assault rifles, guys, the DLC assault rifles. Oh, baby. And the first one is going to be the MX Graham. And this is actually, I believe, one of like the first range weapons that Black Ops 3 Wait, actually added into Black Ops Black Ops 3. Next up, we got the FFAR or the FAMAS, whatever you want to call it. This is also a throwback yeah. weapon. We've seen this thing in a lot of Call of Duties, but mainly uh, Black Ops 1. Black Ops oh, 1, we saw oh this weapon, God. and uh, you can't go wrong with the FFAR. Moving right along here. I have the Sen, Galil, Arthur, No, no, when it shows up. We got oh. the Peacekeeper, and I mean, yeah, like, like the XMC, guys. Like the XMC, you can't go wrong with this thing. This, this is, is honestly one of my favorites no, and probably one of the best DLC time. weapons of Black Ops 3. Let me know in the comment section if you guys have the Peacekeeper. Alrighty, guys, now we have the LVA Basilisk, and I don't really like this thing. This is not one of my favorite DLC weapons in the world. I really am not too much of a fan of the LVA. It's not bad at all. It really isn't that bad. It's just the way the gun actually works. Like, that charge or, like, that delay, I don't know why they gave the LVA Basilisk, a, like, a delay before it shoots the actual freaking bullets. I don't know why this thing has the delay, but, like, Look at that, bro. You gotta charge this thing up. And, like, I wanna shoot right away. If I see an enemy, I wanna shoot right away. I don't wanna, you know, sit there for two hours. Alrighty, boys, moving on. Oh, wait. Can we kill this man? Come on. Come on. There we go. We got the M16. Another throwback. Every, I feel like every single weapon is literally a throwback weapon. I have zero clue. But either way, man, we got the M16, that three round burst assault rifle. Next up, we got the Galil. Once again, a throwback weapon. I don't even know what to say, man. Black Ops 1 throwback weapon. Oh, this guy tried to... Yup, dude. Oh, my God. We got the last one. Oh, I tried to take out that third guy. But we got the last assault rifle right here, the KVK 99M. So we finished the submachine guns. We finished the assault rifles. And now we got to move on to the uh, shotguns. Yes. Oh, my God. Is this... No. Oh. <laughs> Yo. Oh, stop. 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 I'm done, dude. Wait, there's a guy behind me. Is he going to go? No. Oh. <laughs> Yo. Oh. 
Yo, I'm so done. All right, guys, now we're going to move on to the Olympia. Those guys were actually getting pretty mad that I was killing them with the Banshee. And I can definitely see where they're coming from because I wouldn't want to die uh, by the Banshee either. Like, it's probably annoying. I see this guy, though. Bam, there we go. Olympia. I love the Olympia. All right, guys, so we are done with the shotguns. Now we are moving on to the LMGs. And actually, a couple days ago, I did the R R70 Ajax versus the uh, the RPK, actually. So definitely check that video out if you missed it. And now we're moving on to the newly added... Oh, my God. Yo. Oh. Oh my god. What's this one? Why they, they were literally all spawning on top of it. Yeah, guys, we have the RPK, a brand new DLC weapon that just came out along with the stand. Oh, great. It's time for the snipers. Oh, already off the RSA. That is what I'm talking about. Oh my god. And also, we have the DBSR. This is probably the worst sniper in Black Ops 3. I'm not even joking. I, I don't like the DBSR, guys. And now we have the final sniper that they added into Black Ops 3. XPR 50. There we go. Oh, baby. I'm definitely a huge fan of the XPR. Very, very fun sniper to use. And it was kind of like a throwback as well. This one's from Black Ops 2, actually. Ooh, Scythe shut down, boys. Alrighty, guys. So we did all the primary weapons. Now it is time for the secondaries. And the first one is the Marshall 16s. We're going to be rocking dual wield with these babies because it's just fun to use the Marshall 16s with dual wields. And there we go. Done. We're done with that. Oh, God. All right, guys. Next up, we have the Rift E9. Is that a dude? Okay, that's a dead body. But yeah, we got the Rift E9. I am not a fan of this weapon at all, guys. But it's kind of like the counterpart uh, to the Banshee. That kind of laser weapon, man. And we got to try and get a kill with this thing. It's... I don't know, man. It shouldn't be too, too difficult, but... Oh, and there we go. Ooh, baby. Free kill. I'll take it. Moving along here, we got the 1911. You guys already know, man. I love the 1911. I freaking use this thing as a primary a lot of the time. Yeah, let me know in the comment section if you guys have the 1911. Probably, like, the best pistol in the game, I would say. Uh, you know, because the March 16s are not are, are pretty fun to use, but they're not that great. And then the, the 1911 is definitely better than the Rifty 9. Ooh, there we go. Oh, dude, we mapped that kid. Alrighty, guys. Uh, yeah, we gotta cover these, too. The freaking launchers, dude. The L4 Siege. You're done. Dang. You're done. Oh, yo, we got a double kill. I will take that. Oh, my God. Alrighty, guys. Next up, we got the China Lake or the you have that, right? Max GL. I can't believe I missed that. Oh, there we go. And I have no more. That's okay, I'm done. Goodbye. Max warfare. GL is done. Alrighty, guys. Now we gotta go through all of the freaking melees. And I think there's like 22 melees or something like that. Like, there's a lot of melees, guys. No, I'm modern warfare. Hopefully we can get this guy. Yeah, this Boom. I knifed. Have. Let's go. Next melee weapon. We got the wrench, boys. We gotta oh. freaking smack also, someone. I like that hand. I will oh! Dang. That just sounds like it hurts. Moving along, guys. We got the brass knuckles. We gotta punch someone. The one-two Mayweather. Here we go. Oh, that guy slid through. He probably didn't see that punch coming. Next up, guys. We got the iron gym. The freaking crowbar. Let's get it, boys. I like it. Boom. Oh, that was quick. Iron Alright guys, next up we got the Fury Song. I love that animation, bro. Oh my, we just sliced that guy in half. Oh my lord. That's, oh, that slicing sound is just, oh, that guy sliced me. Alright guys, next up we have the MVP baseball bat. Oh, throwing some Negan action in there. Woo. Yep, there we go. What does it look like? What does it look like when you do this? <laughs> like Alright guys, next like we have the baseball. malice, baby. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, oh, stabbed that quick? Ooh! Oh! Alright guys, moving on to the carver knife. Let's get it, boys. Cool animation. Uh, uh, what? Okay, you guys, where's that? Uh, you get have stabbed. This? No, I don't have it. I don't have the carver knife. Oh. Get stabbed. Next up, we got the skull splitter, boys. Splitter. Let's go. Oh we got the God. freaking this mace. The this large oh, thing I in our hands. That's what she said. Oh, there we go. Let's go, boys. Next like up, guys, it. we got the slash and burn. Oh, this freaking it. axe. Let's get it. I think this is our victim. There we go. Backstabber, boys. Move right along. We got the Nightbreaker, this freaking alien the, hand um, thing. I don't know. It's scary, though. Come on. Oh, my God. I thought he was going to turn around and absolutely destroy me. All right, guys. Next up, buzz cut. I never really got this weapon. It's kind of weird looking. Moving right along, we got the taser, boys. The freaking enforcer, electric. I don't even want to say it. Oh, destroyed. Absolutely destroyed. Dude, I freaking love this one. All right, I love the nunchucks. Look at that. Look at that freaking animation, bro. Oh, my God. I know. Oh, oh, there we go. Oh, Next up, we actually have a DLC weapon that was given to everyone for free, actually, because of a community contract. We have the prize fighters. Oh, one, two, Mayweather, boys. Moving along, we got Takiao's katana. We got the Path of Sorrows. We got to slice someone up. Let's do it. Let's get her done. Oh, that guy just hopped out of the water, and he did not see that coming. I'll tell you that much. All right, guys, we got to dig some graves for our enemies because we got the Ace of Spades. 
Okay. Oh, there we go. Ace of Spades done. Now we got my favorite DLC weapon. Yes, we got the lefty, favorite. the mannequin's arm. Yeah, I freaking I like love this thing. Me too. I want this one. Too. Oh, he's in the corner. <laughs> oh, he's sitting he's in the corner like with an Gorgon. What are you doing? Yeah. Alrighty, guys, we're almost done with the melees. But next up, we got the bushwhacker. I didn't even see that so coming. Long. And the last melee been. weapon that Treyarch has added into Black Ops 3, the Raven's Eye. I have it. Yes, oh, the vision pulse came in handy. Three more weapons, guys. We're on to the special weapons, and the first one we got here is the NX Shadow Claw. Hence my name. Oh, next up, the D13 Sector, boys. Here we go. Hopefully, we can get a pretty awesome kill with this thing. The freaking pizza gun, the disc shooter. Oh, Colette! Colette! Oh my god, I only saw one dude! There was two! Oh my god! That is awesome! And the last one, guys, the freaking ballistic knife! The last one we need to be no, done with this challenge! Knife. This is not the butterfly knife. He has to do the butterfly knife. Great way to finish, guys. Great way to finish. A guy teabagging. But we did it, guys. We did it. We completed the one kill with every oh DLC weapon. Dude, are you serious, bro? <laughs> so One kill with every DLC weapon, boys. There you guys have it. Drop that. I hope you guys enjoyed all those buttons, except, for, except for the dislike. Video? And I'll see you guys next time. Can we do a gaming video? Uh, I don't know. Uh, no. Please. Uh, but I'll see you guys next time. Uh, oh my god.